Now this next method is basically modification of Schneider's method. In this case, as in case of Schneider's method, three points were taken. One at the apical foramen, one at the center of canal orifice and one point where the canal begins to flare. So here the first point is again taken as the center of the canal orifice. The second point is taken 2 mm below this uh, point. And the uh, third point is again the apical foramen. And the fourth point is taken 1 mm above the apical foramen. So first these two points are joined and a line is formed. And these two uh, points are joined and the angle at which these two uh, lines they intersect is measured just as uh, Schneider's method. So if the value is uh, less than 5 degree then the canal is considered to be straight between 5 to 20 degree moderately curved and if it is more than 25 degree it is considered to be severe curvature.